I hope everybody can see me. Well, let's hope, let's hope this goes okay. Um, I am... First of all, I'm sorry for the abrupt uh, ending to the last video, but my battery died at my camera. But anyways, um, I thought I would come in here in the office now and continue working on the clothespins. Um, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, um, my two videos ago, because the last video was on the pretzels, but, um, it talks about these. It's uh, for a game for my sister's bridal shower. That's what all, everything that I'm doing is for right now. We just had the bachelorette, now we're doing the, the bridal. Um, but this is for the game, you know, that you give the guests a pin and uh, a word is given that is, uh, you're not allowed to say that word, and if you're caught saying that word, that person gets your pin, your clothespin. And whoever uh, gets the most clothespins at the end of the party wins. So anyways, I've seen this on this idea on Pinterest. I by no means am taking credit for anything that I ever talk about. Uh, um, <laughs> most of the time it's just something that I've seen on Pinterest or somewhere else and I just copy it and this is one of those. But um, I still need to finish the white on these. I have a lot more than I realized still left to do. These ones over here are done. Well, they're not done, but uh, I still need to do, I still need to put the white for his, top of his shirt, and then a bow tie on him, and then tool for the bride, and then those are done, and then I need to finish the whites on these, and then the same thing as, as those, and then they'll all be done. Um, I should have them done tonight. And then, when I was out shopping for cake pop stuff, uh, I found this. So this is going to be my sister's. She's going to get the big one. And I'm going to try to make flesh tone colored paint. So we'll, I don't know. We'll see. And then I'm going to do the same thing with uh, with it. So she'll she'll get the big one. But anyways, um, yeah. So. I'll just talk for a minute while I do this. Um, I just did a bunch of the pretzels. Uh, like I said, the last video shows a little bit of them. I still need to finish some, but I just kind of got burned out on those a little bit. and uh, So I'm going to save the rest for tomorrow. Then I need to finish these, uh, finish those pretzels and then make all the cake pops. I went out and got the supplies for that today. I'm probably going to have to go back. Ooh, I got black on the inside of this one. Um, on the wrong side. Um, I'm going to probably have to go back and get more white chocolate for the cake pops because the pretzels actually uh, used up a lot more than I thought that they were going to. And I still uh, need to get one more decoration, the round parcels, and then a tiny ones for the cake pops. And now I have decided to do something else. Pinterest is, oh my goodness, full of great ideas. If I had money, oh my goodness. But anyways, what the idea is, is you know um, the cakes that have an edible picture on them? Well, it's the same... Oh, I've already done that one. Um, it's the same idea, but it's on a cookie. Um, you build up your, your foundation with a hard royal frosting, you know, so it gets hard. And I've already talked to a local grocery store here, Fry's Food. And um, most people out Midwest would know it as Kroger. Um, anyways, <laughs> like you guys all care, right? Uh, anyways, um, and they will run off, uh, the manager said that she would run me off a sheet. Or, you know, as many sheets as I needed. 
So I'm going to attempt to do that. Um, I hope I am not biting off more than I can chew, but um, they don't look that hard and they're they're so cute. But that you put a picture, and the picture, of course, would be of my sister and um, my soon-to-be brother-in-law. So that's that. Um, I tried on my dress of which I love the dress but <laughs> I have to have the back taken in um, which ugh, I mean better to be taken in than not have enough I know but I really don't have the money for it but the back uh, you can kind of see you know it just it just doesn't look right and you can kind of see you know down my back a little bit so I gotta get that done I ordered my shoes. I'm um, getting very excited, very nervous. Uh, I don't do social stuff well. I, I don't mean it that way. <laughs> I don't, you know, I don't freak out or nothing. Well, although I have, take that back, I've had panic attacks more than once. Rat here recently, we went to Rat and oh my gosh, the seats were so close together and I was just, oh, it was a moment. Any hoozle see how I'm doing that and try to make it at an angle there I was doing this with a small brush before but anyway so that's that and then what I got for her necklace is this glitter and I'm just gonna put little teeny weeny little bit of glue and then put that around uh, her neckline It'll be all sparkly and look like, you know, she's wearing, uh, you know, a crystal necklace, you know, a diamond necklace or something. And the tool, um, the tool was like a whole bunch of money for, I, I didn't need as much as what they wanted to sell. So I thought I'd go to the dollar store and see if I could find a kid's toy, you know, like a, a girl's, you know, little tutu, how they have the cheap ones sometimes. No such luck, you know, no tool, nowhere. So I'm going to go to the fabric store tomorrow, tomorrow's Monday, and uh, see what I can find there. And that'll be easy, I'll just attach the tool here as a veil, and then these will be done. So that'll be very cute. But uh, anyways, I'm very, 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 I'm going to use a small one. Uh, the water.